All right, so we've done the first law of thermodynamics, the second law of thermodynamics. Let's do the third law. So the third law of thermodynamics is going to say that as the temperature of a system goes to zero, its change in its entropy will go to zero. All right, so how can we describe that? So we know that temperature is going to be related to the average kinetic energy of the molecules. So we said that one half mv squared was proportional to kT. So the average kinetic energy of molecules is related to its temperature. If we increase the temperature, then the molecules begin to move faster. And we said that if we decrease the temperature, the molecules start to go slower, and eventually they go so slow that they stop moving altogether, and they're basically resting on top of each other. So what does that do to the entropy? So we said that the entropy is related to the disorganization of the system. So a large entropy is going to mean that the molecules are moving around very, very fast, and it's a high temperature. As we decrease the temperature, then as these become more organized, then uh, the entropy is going to start to decrease. So that as the temperature of a system goes to zero, the change in its entropy goes to zero. Now in actuality, this is not, never going to happen because we can't get to absolute zero. But in theory, if you could get a temperature at absolute zero, then all molecular motion is going to stop and it's going to be in its most lowest entropy state when that happens. All right, and so let's take one more break, and when we come back, we will discuss the zeroth law of thermodynamics.